Hello everyone and welcome back and today guys we are going to be in Subnautica again This is episode 2 of my brand new Subnautica series guys Really loving this game so far I love most of all the smooth, run, uh, the smooth running of this game I also love the graphics, it's just beautiful But to start off the day we still have all our supplies and we have a message to listen to So let's do that I'm going to turn up my sound a little bit so you guys can hear the message I'm probably going to turn it back down so bear with me for a sec Okay here we go Oh, okay, I won't say anything. This is an automated distress signal. Port is detached. Great, zero life signs have been detected. Huh, okay, so I have this basically telling me that I should go investigate it. I might go, I might go do that. I might go do that. Uh, let me turn down my sound again on the game really fast. Okay, perfect. Sorry about that. So, let's go back out here. We're back. Okay, guys, so. What I think we're probably going to do this episode, actually, can I... I think what we're gonna do guys is it's time we're gonna stock up on food and water and we are going to the aurora but wait how do you i think fiber mesh isn't that with creep fog so if i go in here and uh where i think it's under our right yeah silicone rubber that should be okay yes yeah, so i need creep fine c clusters and titanium that's not too bad i know where titanium is easily wreckage of something anywhere. Sorry guys, probably gonna get some lag. Whenever I use my C glide, it always tends to lag, so bear with me for a couple seconds. Guys. <laughs> yep, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> so we're gonna continue looking we need to find some freaking vines. Oh there's one right here. Perfect. Matter of fact I'm probably about hundred percent sure that we do. One. Oh, there's one. Why well, not? There we go. Two. Perfect. So let's head back. Okay, sorry. I just tested my light. Perfect. So there we go. We are back. We're gonna go back up here. I think we should have a night now. Uh, no. Uh, basic. Caution. Dehydration detected. Yeah, that's the problem. Dehydration, dang it. Seven, eight, we need to make titanium really fast. Wait, what is this? Oh, that's silicone rubber. Oh, it takes one. Sure, come on. Then we need to really go get some water, guys. We're gonna be in trouble soon. And there's the knife. Awesome. Okay. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. As an essential survival tool for 2.5 million years, the knife remains the only exception. Sorry about that. Oh, wait, does it say, is that because of all the, all the weapons are gone? Oh, so only the knife is the only thing we can do right now. Okay. Oh, great. It's already night. That's how fast days go in this game. Fantastic. Okay. Let's see what we got here. We really need some water, and I mean really bad. So let's see if we can catch a fish for now. Just a regular. Oh no, no, no just a black fish. New creature what? discovered. I want. I picked these things Alien up. Alien life I? forms may have Perfect. unexpected characteristics and applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Good. I did. Ah, huh. over here. Perfect. So let's head back. That's the, uh, the thing. For, oh, maybe there's a radiation suit in there. That'd be great. Oh, I'm an idiot. It's right above me. Perfect. Let's go in here. If there's a radiation suit, uh, suit inside that pod. That'd be great. Let me go up here and see. Ah, I know exactly where that is. That is way too close to the, to the Aurora without a radiation. So well, that's nice. Alright, so we can't actually go get that right now. Uh... Air bladder. Oh, I'm not gonna make that. I'm not gonna make it though. I really need some water, so... Oh wait, that's under sustenance. Water. Filter. Pulses. Perfect. We just need to get a couple of waters. We're gonna take these waters with us. I'm gonna get some food as well. Perfect. 
Drink one. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay, and we have two of those left. We got one battery. Okay, what I'm gonna do is we need to figure out. I think it's fiber mesh lead for the radiation suit. One second. Uh, personal equipment. Fins, and uh, I don't need fins really. Yeah, I don't need fins. Uh, lead line suit. We have the lead, but it's just not on us right now. And then the fiber mesh. I'm not. How do you make fiber mesh? Huh. I think we also have a message. Nope. Okay. Uh, yes, we have a med kit. Awesome. So, I think it might just be creep fine to see if it's possible. That would be pretty easy. So. Sorry guys, once you get the legs, I'm going to you guys well. But sorry about that. But uh, let's see what we got over here. Let's see if we can get a couple more maybe over here. I'm not sure how many we need, so I'll drop some. One, two. Oh, inventory full. Okay, that's fine. Sorry, buddy, not trying to distract you. Uh, let's see here. So, we need to quickly grab some fiber mesh. Oh, wait, did I completely grab the wrong thing? I think I did. I think fiber mesh. Ah, crud. Well, I guess I can just make some lubricant, maybe? I'll waste these all on lubricant. I should use all of it. If not, I'm gonna grab some. Okay, I'm gonna grab some silicone as well. Because those are the two things we get. We still have more? Whew. I'll get one more lubricant. If we have more, then I'll get one more of the silicone. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let me put that in here really fast. We don't need all this stuff in here. Uh, perfect. That should be everything. Okay, now we need to go for the chop down or chop into one of these guys. So this guy right in front will work. Okay, I think that's good, right? I think we'll be fine now. I think it's done. Use this new blueprint. But maybe it's not going to be not big fiber mesh. Looks like it. Fiber mesh. There we go. I think I need needed two of them. Perfect. Uh, then we should have our lead in here. Yeah, there's our lead. Awesome. Meaning, radiation suit. Nice. Awesome. There we go, guys. I, I don't really need this. Wait. Guys, I don't need that. Okay, guys, into the deep we go. Let's do this. We're gonna get catastrophic lag spikes right now because we're still in a new area of the world. So I apologize, but as soon as we get there, we'll probably still have some lag, but I'm hoping it will be at least a little bit more once it heals up. So I'm very sorry about that, guys. I regret that having that lag. So I'm sorry. go a little faster, I probably the seam on this floor, but, you know, it would be better if we just went over there like this, I guess. Ooh. Well, let's go look down here for a sec. Let's see if there's anything. Uh, nice pop-up uh, scrap metal there. Or nice pop-up scrap metal you got there. Uh, let's see if we got... It. Oh, wow, that one went flying. Should we? Yeah, we're gonna go to the signal first. Okay, let's go up so we don't run out of oxygen. And then we should just easily be able to keep swimming. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Alright, so. A little bit farther. Oh, wait a minute. I can't even get into the Aurora yet, can I? No, because it's a thing that happens like halfway. I think it explodes. That, you can get in there. So you can actually get in there. That's... 
Oh, there's a hole busted in the side of this. I don't think there's gonna be any survivors from that. Oh, what? Oh! I forgot that added that. Acquired. Perfect. Well, I guess we can head back now. this out really fast and move up my window really fast so I can see what we're doing. There we go. Perfect. Continue. Okay. Oh, maybe we should just kind of find some stuff over here. That's possible. There's, there's definitely some stuff over here. So let's, uh, let's just see what we can find. I'm wondering exactly where the Cyclops... Oh, there's a wreck. Uh, I wonder if the Cyclops parts can be over here. Seconds. I'll go up and we got 20 to 15 seconds. For now, I'm gonna go down. Oh wow, okay, so that was something. Perfect. We found a part of a bioreactor. Oxygen. Oh crap. We're dead. We're dead. Seconds. Okay, I'm watching that that oxygen now. What is this? Oh, a battery charger. Okay, we're gonna head back up now. We gotta go. Oxygen. Yeah, we're gonna have some problems now. Uh, come on, go, 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 go. Perfect. And back down. So we found a battery charger fragment, which ran over floating as well. Quite nice. What's this? Is another part of it? No. Uh, let's see. Got uh, anything else special? Over here? Why can I not see my? Okay, I'm just gonna. There we go. Uh, anything else I can see? I think that might be it. Oh wait, something in here. Blue quarter. Wow, that led to absolutely nowhere. Fantastic. Thirty seconds. We. Okay. Oh, let me out, please. Okay. So, I think we're gonna go back up really fast and go look for another... Oh, there's another part of the battery charger. Caution. Okay. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment, 7%. By physical injury, 11%. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, Probability of death increases to 65%. Oxygen. Wow. Well, there we go. We've got the battery charger as well. I think that's another part of it. Acquired. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, we don't need it. The main needle. You can see that's why we're here. 30 seconds. Like, but this is my base to make it stylish. Perfect. Uh, we're gonna go back up here. New blueprint acquired. I think what we're gonna do is go back down there to double check, and then Oxygen. we're going to head probably back to five. Nothing else we can really do here. I'm just gonna double check to make sure we got everything important. Now that I know is a bioreactor fragment. I think it is, yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh, well, I guess we can just continue on. Let's do this. Oh, 
Oh, perfect. This is what I was trying to find. You can actually find uh, Cyclops fragments like this right here. Perfect. Yep, Cyclops. 30 seconds. What is this? Lithium? That sounds important. I'm gonna take that. Oh, I could probably have to go up about 30 oxygen now oxygen. whenever I get down to 30. Because I'm really deep now. Ooh, crap. Like, I'm going to need another oxygen tank. Okay. I know to find these fragments, you have to stay on the outskirts. So, let's see. What Sorry, guys. I'm probably going to be some lag for a moment. Maybe a few moments. Lithium sounds important, so I'm guessing it is. 36. 33. 30 seconds. Okay, any more fragments right here? Okay, nope, we're heading up. Heading for the surface. Oxygen. Okay, should be able to make this. Yeah, we made it. Okay, perfect. Again, my little thing has disappeared, but I'm not going to question it because I'm infinite. So, we gotta be really careful now, guys. 30 seconds. And get rid of it over here. Nothing. Back up. Hoping maybe the Aurora will blow up soon and then we can do it a two mission in one. That'd be cool. Oxygen. 2019. Okay, back down again. Sorry guys, I'm hoping this isn't getting too boring for you guys, but I really want to see if there's any fragments for the snake claws. So we're going to head back down really fast and see if we can grab and gather up. Come on. Let's see what we got down here. We uh, picked up one Cyclops. I think it was the bridge fragment. But uh, I'd like to do uh, the other bridge fragment if we can find it. But uh, I'm probably not going to be able to record too much, guys, because I believe when this game gets full on its memory, it starts to lag just like this. And I know that's not pleasurable to watch. And what is that? Is that one of those precursors? 30 seconds. I think that's a precursor base. It's a vent though, so I'm wondering if I can go in it or do something with it, maybe? Okay, well I think that's all we're gonna be able to do for now. So what I'm gonna do... Oxygen. Oh, come on, lag. Please don't kill me. You know what, guys? are going to head back to the, uh, what's it called? To the, uh, pod. Sorry, there we go. The light seems to be cleared up a little bit, which is nice. But, uh, we're gonna head back to the pod. See what we can do. Mild dehydration detected. Fluid intake recommended. Vital signs Perfect. stabilizing. That's done. We're going to try to head back now before, uh... Once we get that done here, we're going to head to the Aurora, 
once it explodes, so I'm not sure when that's going to happen. But maybe at the end of this episode when it does, I might just be able to, uh, what's it called, to, uh, sit it, uh, wait it out for it to explode, and then maybe even just, uh, fit it in this episode before we go up. But, uh, you know, just for purposes, I might just wait till next episode. So, uh, as I was saying before, probably the pause of the going back here. So, uh, give me one second, we'll be back there. Okay guys, sorry, so we have been just got back to the pod, and I believe that is where we're going to end off this message, but first I have one message that we need to see you guys, so one second it's going to play. Okay, it's not going to say it, I'll say it myself. This life pod 17 cord is attached. Oh great, they have a Seamoth Bay thing problem. Do not attempt to rescue without laser cutters. Okay, so I don't have a laser cutter. Oh great, it says or you'll only add to the body count, so I don't think I want to do that. So we'll wait a minute for that, but we have that signal now. Um, gonna, oh, it's all the way down there. Okay. So we're going to go down there in the next video, guys. But thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please smash that like button and or subscribe, my guys. And I will see you all in the next Subnautica, Subnautica episode. See you later.